Hello, my dear students. Good morning to all. Hope you all are well. Dear students, in our last science class, we discussed about the transportation in animals. Is it? All of you memorize that one? Okay, very good. And we discussed about the structure of heart also, right? Now, I am going to teach you about the parts of excretory system. Okay, what is that word excretory? From this word, what you understand? Excretory, that means we are eliminating some waste from our body. So let's learn about how we are removing our waste from our body. So usually we know that we are removing the waste through our urine or our sweat like that. Okay, so more about the parts of excretory system and their function we can learn from today's class. So all should have to be careful. Students, usually we have to say like that, excretory system helps to get rid of what children, get rid of base material like water, excess, salt and some waste. Okay, so main function of excretory system, it helps to get rid of waste material from our body okay so students our urinary system or excretory system consists of following parts we can check what are they okay first one two kidneys we know that we have two kidneys okay it is including in our excretory system and and two ureters okay as like kidney we have two ureters but kidney is bean shaped structure right but ureters are like a tube like structure okay then urinary bladder like a sac okay urinary bladder and urethra and urinary opening okay urinary opening so these all are the main parts of excretory system what are they two kidneys and two ureters then one urinary bladder and one urethra and one urinary opening. Okay, children. So, these are the main parts of excretory system. Okay. So, let's draw the diagram. From you can easily understand the functions of these all parts. Okay. Students, we know that the waste which is present in our blood has to be removed from the body. Okay. So, the vena cava and aorta. Did you remember that names? Yes, of course. When we are learning about our heart structure, we learned about the vena cava and aorta. Right, memorize that one. So students, through this vena cava and vena cava and what is this one? Aorta, blood, which is constantly passes through our kidney. Students, when blood reaches to the both kidneys what will happen kidney is a bean shaped structure right when blood reaches to this both kidneys what will happen it's both useful and harmful substance is it children that's why we need filtrate our blood from the waste material or harmful substance so, so filtration of blood that is happening through by capillaries which is present in kidney okay so filtration of blood is done by the blood capillaries in the kidney clear this useful substances are absorbed back into the blood and the useless dissolved in water and they are removed as urine okay so students from the kidneys urine that is goes into the urinary bladder urinary bladder is a sac like structure okay it is a sac like structure okay so urine that is passes from the kidneys to the urinary bladder through tube like structure we call ureters okay what it is ureters clear all of you so from the kidneys the urine that is goes into the urinary bladder through the ureters these two are ureter then after that that urine that is stored in the urinary bladder we have to say this is what children urinary bladder okay urinary bladder 
okay so this urine that is stored in the urinary bladder okay and after that this urine is passed out to the urinary opening okay here there will be a urinary opening okay so urine is stored in the urinary bladder and it is passed through the urinary opening urinary opening okay. the end of muscular tube called what this muscular tube called urethra urethra clear all of you let's check the functions one more time so when we are checking the function of kidneys we know that kidney make urine by filtering waste and extra water from blood is it then what about ureters children two tube like structure that connect kidneys and urinary bladder together that is ureter okay and urinary bladder urine is produced by body is stored in urinary bladder okay urinary bladder that is stored the urine then urethra okay urine is passes out through the urethra do you know children an adult passes one to one point liter of urine per day okay so let's take the content of urine okay what all are the things consist we know that excess amount of water is there okay that is almost 95 percentage of water so urine consists of 95 percentage of water then the rest of the percentage that is 2.5 percentage of urea and 2.5 percentage of waste okay these are the main contents of urine understand so students in this class we learned about the importance of excretory system okay and functions and also the parts also we discussed so so today's topic is dear students check the spelling of iota i wrote on the board you have to check the spelling of iota one more time in the board all should have to answer for this question and read the chapter at least three times. Catch you later. Thank you.